33 story hotel and condo project. I'd probably be okay, like, like that. Okay, stop. Tap. This is a plan by the community for the community. This one here. <laughs> no problem, Ken. Thanks for having me. It's Kent Mogat for Kelowna Now. And we're joined by Kyle Nixon, and a lot of changes have been happening. We can see glass going up on the outside. What is going on in there? So we had the opportunity about a year ago um, with our landlords uh, to take on some space. So myself and our team put in some bowling alleys. So we put in six 10-pin lanes, um, expanded about 8,000 square feet, and uh, really tried to bring something to downtown Kelowna that didn't exist. So what does bowling have to do with a pub? You know, for me, it's a social aspect. You know, I, I have young kids like you, um, and for me, it was like, you know, hangovers aren't as fun as they were when you were, you know, 19, 20. So, you know, I, what I noticed is a lot of people, they want to come and be social, and, you know, it's not like a binge drinking type thing. And I think bowling is one of those things where you come and have a few beers, do something active, and have some laughs and food. And so that was the whole idea. So I take it you're not quite finished, but can we have a little look at how it's coming yeah, together? Let's go see it. Yeah. So, Kyle, this is something you don't see very often. You have an Airstream trailer that somehow has found its way inside. What is going on? Well, you know, I feel like part of this whole project, things have just kind of like magically happened for us. And this was one of them. This was always the idea we had was to do some sort of an outdoor patio with it. And um, so we had looked at buying one. Uh, but what, we ha what happened was when we were building uh, BNA, we had like um, a big cutout there just from years of it was just open. Cut out of the bricks. Yes, cut out of the bricks. Um, and we measured this and we literally had an inch on each side and it fit in perfectly. And for us is we wanted to make it a shell for our bar. So we've retrofitted it now to be a full bar. So same, everything the same as our downstairs bar now will be able to be off our upstairs, just in a, bit, a little bit of a different form. Just a real funky thing you wouldn't yeah. normally well, see thanks, in any man. kind of bar or pub. Okay, and then there's one more element. We talked about it outside, yep. bowling. Can yes. you show us that? Yeah, let's do it. Yeah. All right. So here we have what looks like uh, six lanes of bowling right in the middle of a pub. Yep, so six lanes, 10-pin bowling. Um, it kind of took us a long time as we had to retrofit it into a 100-year-old building, as we had lots, lots of old beams. So it took us a long time to figure that out and how we were going to work it, but six was kind of the most we could add, we could add here. Um, yeah, it's 10-pin. We got these really cool masking units that are kind of a decor piece. We got those out of Kentucky, um, and they're from the 50s. Um, yeah, we just really just tried to add some like, you know, old pieces with new pieces because that's kind of what inspires us here at BNA. So it's nice for people to have a physical activity to do so that their evening out doesn't have to be just focused around food and drink. A little activity. Totally, I think it's kind of that whole hospitality element where you know ambiance, food, drink, service, all that kind of works together. And I think with bowling, that's kind of what we want to try to add here is to be able to have that same kind of food, music, drink, beer experience with while you're doing something social like bowling. So Fantastic. We really appreciate having this advanced course, look at yeah. it. When can the general public come on down? Like now. All right. Yeah. Appreciate <laughs> it. Yeah. Thanks for watching on Kelowna Now.